All right, Pete Townsend said that uh, The Who is basically gearing up to get back out there on the road. He's been busy doing his Broadway version of Tommy, and when that wraps up, he's ready to get out there and get busy doing some Who shows. The problem is, he also says he doesn't like playing live, and that he doesn't feel as though he had much to do with putting together the band that they have right now. So here's a quote from one of the interviews he gave where he says, quote, look, although I said I wouldn't pick this current band, they're still great musicians. It just feels easy and s- it just feels easy and safe. But there are still places in the show where I can express myself. I'm not Joe Satriani, but I'm playing pretty well, and Roger is, is singing great. He goes on to say that, quote, The Who are a brand and a friendship, but it's not a band. It's not a hard-working, complicated, growing and evolving jazz group. We're not challenging each other to work musical miracles, but we're playing music we know so well. So... Never say never, end quote. Now, every time that Pete Townsend makes a statement about the future of The Who, he seems to be saying something different. About a month ago, he said that it was time to call it quits. Now he's saying it's time to get back on the road. And in addition to these openly conflicted feelings about putting the who back together he also has made statements casting doubt on his own interest in performing so here's another quote from him in it from an interview quote for me there's no drive to perform no anxiety to get in front of an audience and be validated i get that from people responding to my work as a writer and a composer and a recording artist Unquote. So for Pete Townsend, performing live doesn't seem to hold any magic. He's not terribly enthusiastic about the band that's being put together. He doesn't see the band as being the who. He doesn't see the band as growing or going anywhere. He doesn't see the band as a vehicle through which he's able to do much more than occasionally express himself in the live performances and he's been busy with a ton of other projects so the question is why bother putting the band back together and going on the road the answer i think comes from what he said about quote brand the idea is that the who as a brand needs to be active in order to push up the eventual numbers for selling off their catalog and in this case particularly when the lead mastermind of the band itself of the band slash brand itself is saying more or less there is no who and the band is no longer relevant as a creative force but we're going to get back out there on the road he's basically telling you we're doing this for the money not necessarily just to get more money from fans who will attend the shows but money for the eventual selling of the catalog at least this is what i think I also think that if you read between the lines and what he's saying there, you can gauge a great degree of cynicism on his behalf, not only about the music industry and the band The Who itself, but about his own legacy. I don't say that he's saying that his songs aren't worth remembering or that they aren't masterpieces. Quite the opposite. I think he feels he is a very profoundly important artist. But what I'm saying is that hidden in there in the idea that we need to push this brand as high as it can go is also the, uh, is also the admission that there is a limit, that there is a finite relevancy to his work, that it has an expiration date on it. Now, he's not saying all of this openly. Like I say, you have to kind of read between the lines. I think that Pete Townsend is being 50% honest here in saying that the band is no longer a relevant creative force. 
but he's also being a little bit dishonest in saying that, well, you know, we need to get out there and get on the road and play this music because we're friends. I think it's just because they're a brand. Anyway, this is what I think, but what really matters is what you think. So if you have an idea about this or any other topic connected to classic or contemporary music, please drop it in the section below and remember to like and subscribe. I'd also like to point out to you that there's a join button available now for those of you who would like to support the site. If you choose to join, you'll have access to members only polls, members only videos, and members only badges, as well as other cool content and perks that you can see by clicking on the button, which I hope you'll do. Thanks a lot.